Yo, what's your boy, John? On today's video, we have the Ichinos Family Daily Sense Chapter 28. So, yeah, in the last chapter, Subasa gets a note that says, Do not pry into the dream. And as soon as Subasa tries to investigate whatever is happening to him, he just falls asleep for whatever reason. So, yeah, let's just see what happens in this chapter, shall we, guys? And yeah, he's trying to figure out who exactly is sliding the note. Like is it like the mom, the dad, the grandma? But the weird thing is that no one knows that he has these dreams. He, the only person he told was Nakajima. And yeah, and uh, Tsubasa, he still wants to figure out what was going on. So he tried to go to uh, his grandpa's room again, but this time the door is locked. And it seems like the family doesn't even bother like trying to find a key for it. So maybe they're trying to hide something. Well, I'm not sure why the door was really locked here. And yeah, it seems like every time Subasa would try to like figure out something, he would just always fall asleep and the note would be always, they would always say, don't pry into dream. So I bet Subasa, he was getting really annoyed why he keep falling asleep. He was trying to investigate, but you know, how, how, how can he when he's just gonna fall asleep? And yeah, him and Nakajima were having a conversation of like, you know, what's what's really going on or what their speculation is. And uh, Nakajima says something interesting that it could be like a medication thing. That maybe he's taking some kind of medicine after like he woke up from a coma that's making him fall asleep. But we just don't know. And yeah, uh, again, Tsubasa tries to open Grandpa's door. But this time Grandma kind of stops him. And she was telling him that... Like she told him that no one was supposed to go inside grandpa's room and he, yeah the grandma was acting very weird you know having a very creepy smile and yet again Tsubasa falls asleep yeah, and then we see Tsubasa he's kind of like drinking a water bottle and we get to see what was inside like or we get to see Tsubasa's mother and what she's been actually giving him to eat for food and it turns out that she was the one who's giving these medications to Subasa that would probably make him fall asleep instantly and all she want all she said is that she just wants to have like a big old happy family once again and I'm guessing whatever I'm guessing I'm not sure why she's doing this I'm guessing because she wants Subasa to be this way or keep doing these crazy dreams I really don't know but at least we know we're, we're at least we know that he's not like you know superstition or some crazy thing is like some something is causing him to fall asleep and it was these medicine pills and I'm guessing they may make him go fall asleep like really fast and yeah guys that is the end of the chapter uh, will Sebastian ever find out about this medicine he's been taking I feel like the mom would not give him this no I feel like it's someone trying to warn him but I'm not sure who like I feel like it could be anybody honestly maybe the father he's been really quiet and yeah guys the end of the chapter uh let me know your thoughts and theories about this chapter I mean your guess is good as mine's I just really don't know and can't wait for the next one so yeah be sure to like subscribe and see you next one peace